Have you ever tried to share the gospel with somebody who just doesn't care? Have you ever tried to share the good news of Jesus with somebody who's not interested in the good news or Jesus? They couldn't care less. Well, Jesus is kind of saving us the trip here. We get all tied up in knots. We get all worried about being convincing enough. We worry about being effective. People give us five steps and three ways to be a better witness. And then when we don't get the reaction that we'd hoped for, suddenly we think it's our fault. We could have done better if I had just said it differently. I wish I were more like an attorney, like a lawyer. I wish I could convince. Maybe I need to read the uh, habits of highly effective people. Maybe I need to read five books on communication. So we begin to think it's our fault. And what Jesus is doing, here, he's saving us the trip. He's saying, get this, some people just hate him. Some people hate the message. They don't want anything to do with it. And so it's not your fault, but you dust your feet and you move on and you don't cast your pearls before swine. Yeah, he's calling them swine. Remember, this is not your friendly neighborhood Jesus all the time. Sometimes he doesn't mince words. It's the Lord with a sword.